What's up, you guys? In this video, we are going to show you guys two new features within Quote IQ, InstaQuote, as well as customer self schedule. Uh, in the beginning of the video, we want to show you guys a demo of how to use it in real time, how your customers are going to use it. And then on the back half of this video, we're going to show you guys how to set it up. First and foremost, though, I want to show you how to get it. So if you go to myquoteiq.com, you can actually get all of our subscription tiers right now, half off for the first three months. So if you guys come in here, it's the ultimate tier. And essentially with the ultimate tier, you're going to get everything in the platinum premium and free versions, but you're also going to get the customer self-quoting and customer self-scheduling. And as we alluded to in the beginning, your customers are going to be able to schedule themselves with this based on your calendar availability. And your customers are also going to be able to quote themselves. So this is a huge feature for QuoteIQ. We're very excited about it. Mike's been implementing it within his business for the past couple of weeks, and um, he's been having a, a ton of success with it. So it's tested and um, it does a great job. So, Mike, are you cool if we hop in and give them a demonstration of what it looks like? Absolutely. All right, you guys. So here we have the InstaQuote screen. This is set up with all of Mike's services that he wants his customers to be able to see. And we're going to go ahead and fill it out. So, Mike, what do, you, what do we want to do on this one? I say we do a house wash and we'll do some concrete. House wash and a concrete cleaning. Sweet. So first thing your customers are going to do is check both of these boxes and they're going to fill in their square footage on their house. They're then going to click continue, which is going to open up the next slide here, uh, which is going to be specifically for the house wash. So first question is, you know, what is the exterior of, the, of your home? We'll just say for this scenario, it's brick, stained front door. Yes. Screen porch. No. Do you have a detached garage? Yes. So what we're looking at right here is our pricing matrix. So all of these are things that I'm looking for and questions that I'm asking uh, on my particular business. These are completely customizable. So you can ask as many questions as you want, which is going to help you to kind of hone down exactly what you're going to be quoting. And each of these things can have a price increase or a price decrease, depending on how you fill out your pricing matrix. Right. So these things are just going to better allow you to uh, quote your jobs. Uh, and we're going to show you guys how to set this up here in a minute. So concrete cleaning, uh, what is the concrete condition? Let's say that there's oil stains from vehicle rust stains, just old and dirty. We're just going to say just old and dirty for this scenario. We're going to say that it's concrete and the dimensions. What's like a driveway dimension, Mike? Well, just for the sake of this, we'll call it 25 feet wide. Um, and it doesn't really matter here. We've, we've put it up so it's just a square foot model. Uh, 25 by, say, 150 and you've got one of those. Now, say somebody had a patio in the back and it was a 10 by 10 patio. They're going to collect that. They can, they're going to click that. They're going to put in right. patio. Then they're going to put their dimensions 10 by 10. And all of this is going to add up on the final estimate that they are doing based on all of the pricing that you've input into your uh, settings on quote IQ for the various services that we are doing. Okay, sweet. So then once we're done filling out all the different forms with regards to the services that we're inquiring about, the next thing that we're going to do is uh, put in our information. And so all of these are fields that are required by the customer to fill out. So we've got all of the pertinent information that we want to collect. Um, as you'll see also, how did you hear about us? This is something important uh, to understand because you need to know where your marketing dollars are best being spent. So the customers are required to tell you how they heard about you. So we're going to then click on get quote. And you can see right there, there's a place for notes if the customer wants to give you any uh, additional information. All right, and as you can see, this is what your customer is gonna see. And uh, it is a very good looking professional estimate. And they are gonna have to select which service it is that they want. And that's gonna calculate that out. And then estimate total is gonna be up on the top right. They can accept or decline in this scenario. They're gonna accept it. They're gonna have to enter their name to accept this estimate. Boom, it is accepted. And because we have set up self-schedule within our app, the customer now has the opportunity to schedule it themselves. So let's go ahead and click schedule now, which is going to bring up our company calendar and our calendar pops up and the customer then has the ability to choose the date and time that works best for them based on the parameters that you have already established when we set up the self-schedule um, part of Quote IQ. So Justin is going to select 8 a.m. on the 25th of August. And over on the right hand, it says the services that are going to be there. And he's going to click continue. And there we have it. The appointment has been made. Uh, the customer is going to receive an email stating that we will be in contact with them shortly. Because at this point, the customer uh, has not actually scheduled it. They have sent the schedule with the requested date to you. Uh, and now you have got to go into your quote IQ on the sidebar. There's going to be a little uh, side menu, which has got... Um, the uh, pending scheduled uh, calendar events, which then you go and approve because sometimes, you know, you might need to uh, adjust timing based on some of the parameters that they've picked. And, uh, you know, 
puts you in control, but gives the customer the ability to pick the best date and time for them. All right, guys. So that was InstaQuote as well as self-schedule. So now not only can you have customers schedule themselves, you can also have them uh, create their own estimates as well. Kind of giving you like a complete hands-off if that's what you want to do, as well as you kind of give the customer the idea of all the different services that you're offering. So if you guys do want to access this, check out myquoteiq.com. You're going to be able to save 50% off all of our tiers for the first three months uh, of using them. And um, yeah, this is going to greatly help your business and just help things flow smoother. Right, Mike? Absolutely. I'm so excited about this. InstaQuote is a game changer and it's going to make you more efficient. It's going to give you more time to focus on some of the things that actually move the needle in your business. Uh, we're very excited. So go check it out at myquoteiq.com. And if you want to check out exactly how to set this up, we'll leave a link in the comment section description for uh, exactly how you should set it up. So anyway, until next time, I was hard. Get that money, baby. Peace.